You know, the relationship between finance and human rights uh, is one of necessity. They actually need each other. They desperately need each other, even though intuitively we probably see them as two separate entities. Finance needs human rights to give it legitimacy. For human rights, all the human rights that we rely on, uh, education, health, uh, privacy, non-discrimination, a fair trial, all of these things require finance, they require funding. But there are problems also with finance. Finance uh, has got a culture of encouraging greed and avarition. And as a consequence, we've had real problems of inequality in particular. And that's the sort of thing that I've been focusing on in Necessary Evil, to understand how we can do more to help finance, help human rights further, and to help itself in the process. Um, to make it uh, uh, something that is the servant of society rather than its master.